Jurgen Klopp clarifies Soboslai's sub and pinpoints Liverpool's real problem versus Man who did. Jurgen Klopp maintains that the decision to replace Dominic Soboslai in Liverpool's scoreless match against Manchester United was solely to alter the team's tactics. The Hungary captain was substituted for Joe Gomez after an hour at Anfield as Klopp adjusted the formation to move Trent Alexander-Arnold into a more traditional central midfield position. Klopp dismissed the idea that the substitution was related to the 24-year-old's overall performance in the draw against Eric Ten Hag's team. No, not at all. Perhaps until two or three games ago, there was a slight concern, but after the impressive initial impact he made, it was always clear that things wouldn't consistently go that way, Klopp stated. He is still a very young player, and today he showcased exceptional skills in many game situations. However, we did lose possession a couple of times and it had no correlation with the substitution. It's just that we have various options and wanted to alter the system. Consequently, we had to consider our choices. We aimed to position Joey higher, specifically on the wing, along with Costi. Hence, we required players in these half spaces, Cody Gakpo on the right, Lucho on the left, and Mo Salah in the centre. We later made another change with Harvey Elliott in the number 10 role. We were up against a team playing man-marking. Even small adjustments can make a significant difference if implemented correctly. We were close. There were instances where we passed the ball outside, sought overlaps, and they were there at times. However, we erred by shooting the ball outside the net instead of capitalising on their mistakes. Klopp continued, Scoring an early goal would have been fantastic. It could have altered the entire dynamics. We were prepared for that, but unfortunately it didn't happen and the intensity increased. It was an exceptionally tough game with their counter-attacks. Trying to withstand their quality for a full 90 minutes would have been incredibly challenging. They had their moments, but it was nowhere near what they could have achieved due to our counter-pressing. I appreciated that a lot. There were many commendable performances, especially towards the end. As I mentioned when we scored those four amazing goals against Fulham, I knew that one day we would sit there and think, it would have been better not to shoot, but to pass. It's entirely normal, we were in a hurry. You can observe this in the shot quality because these players are capable of extraordinary feats from a distance. However, today the saves for Onana were relatively straightforward because the ball rolled into his arms. This indicates that it's not a lack of technique, it's because we hurried the moment. 